हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल ऑन इंजीनियरिंग मैथमेटिक्स इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न न्यूमेरिकल टेक्निक नेम रुंगी कुट्टा मेथड ऑफ फोर्थ ऑर्डर टू सॉल्व एन इनिशियल वैल्यू प्रॉब्लम ऑफ फर्स्ट ऑर्डर डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशंस बिफोर दिस वीडियो वी हैव सीन यूलर्स मेथड एंड यूलर्स मॉडिफाइड मेथड टू सॉल्व इनिशियल वैल्यू प्रॉब्लम लिंक्स ऑफ दोज वीडियोज आर गिवन इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स now let us see how does this rungi kutta method works consider an initial value problem with differential equation dy by dx is equal to f of x comma y with an initial condition x not comma y not then solution to this differential equation that is y is equal to y1 at point x is equal to x1 is given by y1 is equal to y not plus k where y not is initial value of y and k is given by 1 by 6 into k1 plus 2k2 plus 2k3 plus k4 where k1 is defined as h into f of x not comma y not k2 is defined as h into f of x not plus h by 2 comma y not plus k1 by 2 note that this k1 we are calculating over here k3 is given by h into f of x not plus h by 2 comma y not plus k2 by 2 once again this k2 is coming from here and finally k4 is given by h into f of x not plus h comma y not plus k3 where k3 is coming from here now let us see an example to understand this concept here we are asked to solve differential equation dy by dx is equal to x cube plus y with initial condition y of 0 is equal to 2 at point x is equal to point 2 taking h is equal to 0.2 using rungi kutta method of fourth order so first of all we note down the given data in this initial value problem here f of x comma y is x cube plus y h given is 0.2 x not is 0 y not is 2 now since by adding h in this x0 we will get x1 so x1 is 0.2 this is the same value at which we want to solve this differential equation by rungi kutta method y1 at x1 is given by y0 plus k y0 is known to us where this k is defined as 1 by 6 into k1 plus 2k2 plus 2k3 plus k4 where formulas of k1 k2 k3 k4 are as follows now let us calculate these k1 k2 k3 k4 first then we substitute them in the formula of k then we substitute value of k back in this formula to find y1 so k1 which is defined as h into f of x not y not is equal to 0.2 into f of 0 comma 2 because x0 is 0 y0 is 2 this f of 0 comma 2 can be found using this definition of f here we put x is equal to 0 and y is equal to 2 so finally we get k1 is equal to 0.4 now we find k2 k2 is defined as h into f of x not plus h by 2 comma y not plus k1 by 2 x not is 0 and h is 0.2 so x not plus h by 2 is nothing but 0 plus 0.2 by 2 that is just 0.1 so this term is 0.1 similarly y not plus k1 by 2 is 2 plus 0.4 by 2 because k1 we found here as 0.4 so after simplifying we get k2 as 0.4402 now we carry forward these values of k1 and k2 and we find k3 k3 is defined as h into f of x not plus h by 2 comma y not plus k2 by 
Now we substitute values in this and when we solve we found K3 as 0 0.44422. Finally we find K4 which is defined as H into F of X0 plus H comma Y0 plus K3. X0 is 0, H is 0 0.2, Y0 is 2 and K3 is 0 0.44422. After substituting values in this and after calculating them using calculator, we get K4 is equal to 0 0.490444. Now we have all values of Ki's. We substitute them in the formula of K which is 1 by 6 into K1 plus 2K2 plus 2K3 plus K4 and we found that K is equal to 0 0.44321. Now we substitute this value of k in the value of y1. I hope you remember according to Rungi Kutta method y1 is defined as y0 plus k where y0 is 2. So here we will write 2 plus 0 0.44321 therefore y1 is 2.44321. This is the required value of the solution to this differential equation at x is equal to 0 0.2. I hope you understood all the steps involved in this solution. Let me show you one more example. Here we are asked to solve the differential equation dy by dx is equal to x square plus y square with initial condition y of 1 is equal to 1.5 at x is equal to 1.2 taking h is equal to 0 0.1 using Rungi Kutta method of fourth order. In solution, we first of all note down the given data. Here f of x comma y is x square plus y square, h is 0 0.1, x naught is 1 and y naught is 1.5. If we add h in x naught, we will get x1 as 1.1. Then after adding h in x1, we get x2 as 1.2. So at x2, we want to find solution to this differential equation. But we cannot find the solution directly at x2. So we first find a solution at x1. Then we repeat the process and find the solution at x2. According to Rungi Kutta method, at x is equal to x1, y1 is given as y0 plus k. Where formula of k is this. This K1, K2, K3, K4 are given by these formulas. Let us calculate these Ki's one by one. K1 is H into F of X0, Y0. H is 0.1. X0 is 1 and Y0 is 1.5. So we substitute it here. This F of 1 comma 1.5 can be obtained using this definition of F. So after calculation we see K1 is 0 0.325. Now let's find K2 using this formula. Here we will put K1 as 0 0.325. Rest of the values are same as we use them in K1. So after simplification we found K2 as 0 0.38664. Now let's find K3. We see K3 is equal to 0 0.39698 and K4 is 0 0.48085. Now finally, we substitute values of this K1, K2, K3 and K4 in the formula of K. So we see K is equal to now 0 0.3955. After this, we put the value of K in the formula of Y1 which is Y0 plus K where y0 is 1.5. So we see y1 is 1.8955. Note that this value of the solution is at x1 is equal to 1.1. But we are asked to find the value of the solution at x is equal to 1.2. That is at x2 is equal to 1.2 we wanted to find the solution that is y2. To do so we have to revise the formulas of K1, K2, K3 and K4. 
previously we wrote these formulas for finding y1 so we were taking x0 and y0 here so to find out y2 we have to replace now these x0 and y0 by x1s and y1s so this may create a confusion so to avoid this what we will do we will put x1 as our new x0 and y1 as our new y0 therefore x0 will become 1.1 and y0 will become 1.8955 so after using this x0 and y0 we will get the required result at x is equal to 1.2 so let us substitute this x0 and y0 in these formulas so we get k1 as 0.48029 k2 as 0.58835 k3 as 0.61171 and k4 as 0.77261 now we substitute these values of ki's in the formula of k so we see k is equal to 0.6088 finally we put this value of k in the formula of y1 which is y0 plus k so we get y1 as 2.5043 note that this value of the solution is at x is equal to 1.2 i hope you understood this two iteration solution now it is your turn to solve the questions i have two diy questions for you their respective answers are also given so that you can cross check your answer please write me in comment box whether you are able to solve these questions or not and whether you got this same answers or not please share this video among your friends so that they can also take the benefit of these videos. Thank you all of you. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe my YouTube channel and press the bell icon to get updates about my new videos.